over the disposal of a dolphin in Elliston over the weekend. They took a drive to Bonavista over the long holiday weekend, decided to spend a little time at Sandy Beach near Elliston. Just walking along the beach and we saw two people dragging this heavy dead weight across the beach. So I thought it was a body. We uh, were watching them and then we started to walk over toward them. And then they saw us coming over so they finished up. They were taking armfuls of seaweed and burying this dead weight in, on the beach. Curiosity got the better of Holly Nelson. She had to find out what the two men had buried. Well, here I am digging this thing out of the seaweed with a piece of plywood. And um, first thing that I saw the skin, I thought it might be a seal. And then I thought it was a shark because I saw the beak coming out. And uh, Joey then said, no, boy, that's a dolphin. So I kept digging it and digging it. And sure enough, it's a six-foot dolphin. And uh, seemed to have like, bullet holes or something in the stomach and on top of the head. She also took down the license plate number of the van the two men were driving after photographing the dead dolphin. Holly Nelson contacted the RCMP. She's also contacted officials at DFO. She says that regardless of how the dolphin died, it shouldn't have been disposed of on a public beach. I don't care who you are. You can't go burying dolphins on public beaches. Eh? <laughs>